All right, everybody. We need to find this perp immediately. We have to press waiting. People are literally waiting on us. Who knows what this crook will do next? If he's willing to go to, into someone's house and steal, imagine what he'll do to somebody if they get in his way. We are going, going to, to get, get this punk. Sounds good. I know you both are good detectives, but I'm going to assign you guys different roles according to your strengths. If we do use our best abilities, we will be able to catch the perp in no time. I believe Shannon should focus on the strategy that we are going to use to catch this guy since she's better at thinking outside of the box. You got it, Captain. I won't fail you this time. I have a great idea. What if I wait in the library by myself and observe the culprit and what he does? From there, I reach out to Adam and his crew to which they'll catch the culprit off guard as he leaves the premises. That sounds like a great plan, Shannon. Adam, as for you, you are very knowledgeable about the streets for this city. I want you to analyze all the streets, alleys, anywhere the perp could make an escape if he find out where, where he's going. Heard, Cap. We're going to get this guy. The, the library is in a very busy street, so we have to be prepared. The most common alleys around the area are the ones between 1st Street North and 3rd Street North. Going to send some undercover cops so they can block those exits just in case our guy decides to make a run for it. We also have to take in consideration that it's going to be in broad daylight, no shooting on sight. We don't want any civilian harm in this op operative. I hate to say this, but this is a good plan. Congratulations on your first good idea. Funny as always, I see.